This one must me, oh. This one tire me, oh. Hey! You watch the first video. You have watched the first clip. This is the part two of the confession that I told you about. You see, you see life. Are you not, now you see where this country is, is in deep problem? Because even the people or the system or the sector that we expect to even correct the abnormality in the system, now you can even corrupt past. Oh yeah, watch this part too. May you, may you hear, no, you never hear before, watch it, watch it. When I was initiated, I was asked for, I, they, they asked me what I really want. I said, wait. I said, wait. I need money. I need fame. So they said, the price is who I love most must go for it. I said, okay. I gave them the impression that I wasn't married. That, but I have, a, I have a daughter. So they said, okay, go down fine. Who do I love most? I said, the girl I was dating. They said, okay. The very night for the assignment, they brought something like a calabash with blood. I have to wash my hand inside. Who I love most is to appear inside the, the calabash. So I went... I washed my hand as instructed only for the face of the lady I was expecting to appear it was the face of my father that appeared go ahead go ahead save the time so I said no I can't use my father that they should try other alternative. They should use this particular girl. So they said, no, okay. They will give me another chance. I should try again. So I went again, wash my hand again for the second time. Who I loved most was my senior daughter. The face of my senior daughter appeared. As you they watch this video, you go to share them. Share them. Make it go around, make them see what we they go through for Nigeria. Make them see, say, the problem of this country not be just politicians, pastors join our problem. As they watch the video, they share and make everybody for see and everybody for get sense for this new dispensation. As we they correct the wrong thing for government, we go to correct them for church. Oh, yeah, watch this video and share it. Then also, you can also air your opinion. Write to me, tell me what you think in the comment section. This is real or not fake? Tell me, I want to hear your opinion. It became a serious issue. I said, okay, I needed time to really think if I should sacrifice any of them. These are the two people I love most. So I left that day. A few days later, I got a sign that they, they are trying to carry out the assignment without my knowledge. But they were having difficulty because they need my years to execute either my dad or my 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 daughter before i got the news that my father that was abroad almost died in fact he died so that was when i blew off i said there is no way my dad can go for it let's think of other alternative any other alternative was i start doing different different sacrifice different different kind of things try to see if any other thing will work but all to no avail i came out in public to not to just say it but I came out in public to make the world know and to make everyone that knows me as the prophetic professor what makes me the prophetic professor was the things I was doing and I came out to declare to the world that I'm no longer a member of the white prophet court i have found the jesus and i want to be with the jesus so, what triggers my decision was all attempts to to assassinate pastor wasn't working i came to the church to record miracles thinking if i will see some of my workers in the place coming here to work i didn't see anyone miracles everything are real
this this hatred that was in me towards the church i don't know papa i have not had any dealings with him i have not seen him but with what i was told i just hate him and i want him to 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 die so the first day i came to the church it was not as if i came for service my father said if truly i love him i must go to free indeed for prayer i said okay if that will make you happy i will go i came that day around 6 30 to 7 service has never even started very few persons i sat at this very particular line i was watching everything that was going on trying to see if whatever is going on a programmed stuff at the end of the service papa didn't prophesy the miracles are real i know my work i know i arrange my 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 miracles for those prophets those yeah pastors, for those prophets including your own. yes i know i used to arrange my workers i know i used to arrange who can arrange a blood test who can arrange patient from the hospital who get the doctor's report everything who can arrange i can fake a, a woman with big tummy as if she's pregnant but it's fake tell us more about that even the prophecies they are doing can i talk to you so yeah the prophecies are fake now how we used to get our details in the the prophecy aspect we have two dimensions we have details information now the details is, is also called data. data the data is somebody gets your information collide make friends with your kids get your information sometimes even trace you to the house make friends around gather your your information that is being used in service to prophesy then sometimes we get our information through form you feel you feel your form you talk you state your problems they will not make use of it as prophecy we worked on it Edict, do addicting. That's called addicting. We do addicting, then we add to it. Then there's another dimension in prophecy. That one is the washing of eyes. But the implication of the washing of eyes is the implication of the washing of eyes is if you use that one for a very long time, before you get to your 50s, 60s, the person must go blind. Because the eyes you are to use in the future, you're already using it now then there's still a dwarf that comes to the church to give information when he's saying i hear this is the person is not hearing anything it is a dwarf that is talking i hear this it is a dwarf and all these things were things i was deeply into working for pastors in and outside this state so when i met with papa that very day i went to his office i just wanted him to pray for me i wasn't even ready to talk with him because this hatred was still in me but at the end of the day deliverance was carried out for me and i got to realize that i was in a very wrong track I was in that track because every person I met was telling me the same thing that there is no way you can do ministry without sharing blood, without burying things in the church, without arranging miracles, without faking testimonies. So I every person I ran to as fathers, we are all telling me the as same thing. Fathers. That is even outside Delta State, Benin, yeah, Lagos, everywhere. Abuja, they are all telling me the same thing. So, and with the quest of my desperation, I just crossed my mind that this is what I think this is a track. Every person is the same thing. Just like a man traveling in to a particular direction, every person are going that same direction. Nobody is showing you a different road. So when I came that day, I met with Papa. First, I had a conversation with Pastor Onos. Pastor Onos was telling me, holiness, 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 abstain out from sex, you must be faithful to your wife. Within me, I just laughed. I said, 
I've met people that are even bigger than you. Don't use this format for me. Come out straight. Let's do business. Stop telling me holiness, holiness, holiness. So when I got to the office that very day, Papa was still saying the same thing. Holiness, holiness, abstinence, this. I just laughed. I said, Papa, please pray for me and I want to go. So the deliverance was done that very day. And I got to realize that I was in a very wrong path. But how will I be able to come out from this path? After the deliverance that day, Papa kept calling me, showing me love, sending me money. I was like, ah, I have never received 1,000 euros from any father except an assignment must be done. What, what kind of assignment? Planting? Explain that. Yeah. Hold on now. Please save the time. I have never received any money from any fathers except an assignment is done. I do planting. Like when they will give you a prophecy that there is tortoises in your house, there is sham, there is native pot in your house. We have two patterns of doing it. We have the one that I can come to the house. Even you be inside the house, you will not know that I'm in your house. I will come and drop whatsoever I want to drop. If it, is, if it is your car we want to take, I can come to your company. Even if you are standing. Even if you are standing close to the car. Even if you are standing close to the car. I can come there, put anything I want to put. If it is snake, pussy cat, anything. This was. Tortis, anything. Tortis, anything. This was I, I used to do it. Then the other dimension in this planting is what we call invocation. That is where we enter your house, tell you that there is a native pot that is boiling with fire inside your house. And the house is tight. What I do is I prepare the thing myself. Most of the things I swallow it in me. Then if the professor has been given and they want to remove that particular thing that we said is inside your house what i do is to eat my stomach three times but before then i must take like one full bottle of lord drink because it works with the drink so i eat my stomach three times then that as you are breaking the ground that particular thing we want to come out from that place will come out so this was what i was doing so when papa starts showing me love and I discover that this is not the way I see this man to be. He said he's bad, but he has shown me light and he has shown me love. I didn't do planting. I didn't do stage miracle for him. I didn't get data for him. How come he's showing me this love? And I make up my mind and no matter the consequences that may come out from this my renunciation i make up my mind that i'm no longer and i've renounced myself from being a member of the white prophet court i've been a member of the black ass congratulations <clears throat> what of the boy that was said to be Using free indeed name, you talk about one day you called me and the one you sent to come to steal phone one all night that they were pity. Yes, those were our programs just to scatter the church. The boy that, that stole phone, there was one all night that was going on in church. After the all night at the police post, it was a program something just to scatter the church and to dent the, the image of the church. But fortunately, the team blew off. And we couldn't manage the, the, the scene that very day. Then the other boy that was using the church name was all was our tools. We are just what we program to be doing, just to scatter the church. Remember one worker some night when one boy was called out? Then there was a time you also said that during the court that you put blood at the back of this pillar. Yes, I was the one that came to do that. What did you put? It was a human blood at the pillar that extreme. Yeah, just we are just to scatter the church.
Now, some of these things that are here, what are they? Actually, I want to, I want to explain them. Yes. Don't worry, I'm here with you. What are they? Now, this is, this is a pot. Now, this pot must not touch the earth. I kept this pot under my office and inside this bucket with steel with this rubber under because it must not touch the ground. Now, inside this pot, there are two handkerchiefs. This handkerchief is if I want to prophesy and I don't want to use data, I'm to use this handkerchief to clean my face. No matter how dirty this handkerchief, you must not wash it because of what has been done inside. So with that one, you can be prophesying? Yeah. Inside this pot, there are rings. The rings are up to seven inside. These rings, they are up to seven inside this pot. Now the function of this ring, if I'm having service and I want to do deliverance for people to manifest, I wear the ring. It's either I wear the ring or the ring will be inside of me. It must be connected to my body. And if this ring is in my hand, if I lay hands on anybody, you must go down. Be sure, be sure. Go ahead. Now, this this ring also, if this ring is in my hand, even if the person is not in winch, if I want you to confess winch with this ring, you will confess winch. <laughs> Go ahead. Sir. Go ahead. Now, this this carries must remain in this spot. If I want to do service, it's either I put this carries inside my pocket, or I put it inside a small cup with water or drink. And the drink must be alcoholic drink, Lord or the spirit drink. I drink it. So anything I say, that is what you must do. Now, the function of this pot also is if I want to do invocation work, like commanding work, if I want to command live snake, now I say, Madam, there is snake in your bag, and I want the snake to come out in that bag, the snake must be in this pot. And if the snake is inside, this cloth must cover the pot. And this pot will feed the pot with either a pigeon blood or a new baby blood. So most of the fall, all the prophets that are prophesying, they have all these things. Yes. Show now they run from here to scatter. One day Osefru, one day here, one day Soso place, one day Lagos, one day Abuja, one day. I just wanted your eye to open. If I'm talking, look like I'm, uh, I am tying you. Oh, I'm, I'm not prophesying. Now they here to the Abbey. Now, this one, it is called Ashe. Now, this Ashe has two types. This one is for evil. You want somebody to go mad. You want, you want to destroy somebody. You use this very one. And it must be done fixing in the morning when you have not talked to anybody, when you have not eaten. How do you use it? You get dry pepper, fresh dry pepper. You eat the pepper, then you call the name of the person and whatsoever you want to happen to the person, you spit the pepper three times to the ashe. Then you breathe on it three times also. You breathe on it three times also. Then the ashe must be planted to the ground till you get the news that the person is no more or whatsoever you want to happen to the person until you get the news. But 
it must happen to the person before the sun goes down. Now, this soccer one is for prayer or to collect anything from anybody. Let's, for example, you want to take money from a member. If, if I want to make use of this ashe, I lick the ashe three times. They make prayer. The two persons they share one alligator pepper. Now, wait till they tell, now the rope with the tie go to go market. Now, go to the follow the go house to make the parable on it. Lick the ashe. I wait till chameleon take God. Now, God the year. I wait till rabbit take grand. Now, grand they take. To so make those incantations, lick the ashe. Talk to the person. Anything you tell the person, any amount, anything you tell the person, the person must do it. Until the person carry that what you say, the person cannot rest. Even in your dream, the person will be seeing you. Say, go do that thing. Carry that money, go church. Carry that money. Now, this, this two are shared. Why making use of it? What if you want to make use of it? It must not touch your, your teeth, only your tongue. If it touch your teeth, it will remove all your teeth. So this one's the tide, all this one's padlock for time. Now this padlock, we use this. I use this padlock if I'm working for Yahoo boys. The majority of the people I work for are Yahoo boys. So this padlock, if I want to make use of it, I open the padlock. Then the person call the name of the client, make your prayer on it. Then I will make use of the ashe. Do the prayer, then lock the padlock until you get the result. And as long as this padlock is locked, even if the client is talking to any other person, this is what you say that the person must do. Now, this soap, this soap, I give it to Yahoo boys and ladies that are into prostitution that traveled out to do prostitution. This soap is prepared with a human skull, burnt to ashes. We play with a human skull, a life tortoise, a life tortoise, and a tongue of a new baby. Go ahead, go ahead, don't worry. So it's been burnt. That is what is used to prepare this soup. Anything you say while using the soup, you must get the result. And the effect of this soup is if you are making use of this soup, your eyes must be closed. If you are baiting with the soup, your eyes must be closed. If you open your eyes, the, the, the person go mad immediately and no remedy.